Hey guys, Mr. Oscar's No One here, and as you can probably tell by the title today, I'm going to be showing you, like, a good way I found of mixing my, or uh, preparing my bearded dragon's mealworms. Oh, here's my snake. But, and then also I put them, we had this air hockey table from when we were younger, um, but it's broken now, so it actually worked perfect as a stand for his tank. So, yeah, the dimensions are pretty much perfect. So I'm going to use that. And then my snake tank's back in here. What was on here? We got a new Pac-Man frog, but that's going to be another video. Um, and also there'll be some shout-outs. So let me go ahead and grab his dish. Sorry about that. He's about ready to shed, I think. Look at this bit of focus. I still need to set up my new camera. It's staying forever. Come on. Focus. There he goes. I didn't show you, I already have it kind of in here. Sorry about the calcium spilling. Keeps knocking it over. I gotta go in to clean that out. But, um, obviously you feed him greens and stuff, but this is how I like to help him get some extra greens when I do feed him mealworms. There's some just mealworms that I found that we, had, we forgot to use. I might need to go grab the other ones. No, but, um, this is basically, really, I wanted to just show something while I was doing shout-outs, but, um, so, yeah, I wanted to do, there's a ton of shout-outs I could really do, but the two ones, or, uh, I can't remember who I own, I'll, I'll give three, um, no, I'll give, yeah, I'll give, no, four. I'll get four. So the annotations will be on the screen for all these guys. Um, first, I want to give a shout out to Mr. Leopard Gecko 101. I've given him shout outs before, but I um, just wanted to give him another one because he's got a really awesome channel, some really cool leopard geckos, and he's starting to get like bigger into it. Um, like he's bred. He's got like 15, I think he told me, in that range ish not for sure um but yeah that's the first shout out um second one super warm smasher or nature boy 13 or whatever you want know him by uh he's got a bunch of cool beardies he's just got a year i'm not euro i can't pronounce the full name so i'm just not even gonna attempt um but yeah, he got a new one of those, and he's got a bunch of beardies, obviously. So yeah, definitely go check him out. And also, um, Gecko Guy eight two five. Um, he he has like some really cool animals too. He has a cool, really cool like orange gecko named Sunny. I really like that gecko, and also a bunch of other geckos and stuff. And he seems to know his stuff. Hold on. Sorry, I gotta put this down. Tell me this calcium. This calcium is um red cow with with vitamin D three. Where is that? Yeah, right here with vitamin D three. Focus. Just focus. Show the people. There. Whatever. Um oh Marty sees he sees. He sees him. He wants him. But um D3 is always good. I'm not going to explain that. It's just good. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, Gecko Guy 825 definitely go subscribe to him. And then the last one is... God, I'm going to have to sit this away. Cold Side of Pillow 136 is his name. My annotations for all these guys. He posts, like, really frequently. Fail. Um... I just spilled some of that. But he posts really frequently. And he posts like... He, he does a lot of herping videos. Um, he just bred some tree frogs. He has like some sort of pool of water close to him. And he just bred some tree frogs. And he has geckos and whatnot. Um, so yeah. Really cool guy. He posts frequently. 
So go check out him for sure. So I'll go ahead and get to the video. I kind of want some more mealworms in there. Oh, these mealworms aren't these mealworms aren't gut loaded, so that's kind of why I'm. They're just ones that I found that we bought from a pet store that we haven't used yet. So that's why I'm doing this kind of setup. Um, but what I do is put these. This bearded dragon food, it has like, it's like the vegetables and stuff, it's good for them. And then, just mix it in with these guys, and he normally really doesn't like this stuff, but when he goes for the mealworms, he'll get some of that too. You're supposed to prepare it with water, but I can't with the mealworms and stuff. So, and then, dump a little bit of calcium on it. Sorry, I had to, don't want to get too much there. Hold on. Let me set this down so I can do this right. Sorry about that. Okay. That's good. And normally I want have some vitamins too. But I ran out. So that's like a little dish for him. Like this is a night I'm not feeding him salad. I want to get some more mealworms. But yeah, definitely go subscribe to all those guys. Um... Cold Cider Pella 136, Gecko Guy 825, Super Worm Smasher, and Mr. Leopard Gecko 101. All great channels. And if you like animals at all, definitely go check them out. But yeah, so I think that's good. Let's see how Marty likes it. There we go. I don't know if he sees it yet. Let me help him out. Sorry about that. Yeah, sorry, I haven't been doing a whole lot of videos lately. Been busy, but I have like four real life videos that I want to put out. I had footage entering Vizard Lord's reptile contest. See, you can hear that, that like hard crunching like that. That means he's getting the pellets, which he normally wouldn't eat, which is good. And obviously the calcium, which is also good. A uh, duh. So yeah, that's a good way to get them to eat like the pellets or whatever, the supplements. Definitely for bearded dragons, you're trying to get them to get, eat their calcium and supplements and whatnot. You want to mix it with lettuce or insects because it's tough for them to just eat it by itself. So then that setup's good for like, um, cause he still will eat some of the pellets, but that setup's good for like, I can put some more mealworms in next time and they'll just crawl in there. So I don't have to change that out until all the pellets are gone. So I like that setup. So, oh wait, you got another one. All right. So yeah, that's it guys. Um, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Go subscribe to those people I mentioned and bye.